Morocco's got the puck right corner. Got it mid blue line. Thomas, a slap pass tipped, and what a blocker save by Houston on the last second of play. WHL veteran in more than 200 games. Turned it over at center to Jesse Baird. Fed left wing for the carry in by Mick. Fed in front. Mavitt tips it on goal. Oh, what a stop by Gora. It was four goals in the playoffs to lead the Bandits. Skates right half boards. Dropped it off to a pinching in Shane Bear right corner. Dropped off again. Lodermeyer over skates, and he's hammered down hard by Trevor Costello on a big clean hit on the Bandit captain, who still got to the puck, got tripped up, and will draw a penalty. Still got a shot on goal save. Rebound Milan. Scores! Talk about taking the hit to make the play. Derek Lodermeyer got knocked down, but he got up again. You're never going to keep him down. And then got it to Jeff Malott for the tap and goal, and it's 1-0. Yeah, and Jeff Malott goes very hard to the net after Derek Lodermeyer gets crunched there by Costello. And he picks that puck up, just goes across, and that's the one thing on Gora. Much like a Nick Perkusic, he doesn't poke check. So he's, uh, he gets a free pass across, ends up putting in the net. The Kodiaks are arguing that the puck was touched and it should have been blowing down, but uh, you can't change that one now, as Gora did touch it, so I don't know if, how that works. But if it's a break for the Bandits, it's a break for the Bandits, one nothing here. And you can't go back and say, no, we're actually yeah. going to give them the power and play. And you can't view the replay because it'd be hard to view the replay. Well, you're and, under uh, the scoreboard. Yeah. <laughs> Number 11, Jeff. Right flight to McCarr. Zigzags around a defender. Cuts down to the right circle. Around another one to the side of the net. Put it back door. Mappen couldn't get his shot away. To Morrison. Across right point to Costello. Back to the middle. Gadry's got space. Shoots. Didn't get much on it. Bounce to the slot. God, it's a turnaround shot. He just missed the net wide right. And and it Tap it to the red line. McKenzie had a poke free by O'Connor. Slips behind him to the uh, left hash marks. Turnaround shot. That's off the left skate of Gore. The other way, speeding in is Jeff Mallott. Carries into the left half wall. Shoots a sharp angle. One right on. Rebound McKechnie. Shoots right on. Rebound shot wide right of the net by McCarr. There's stopped by McCrory. Dropped off to Cockrell. Cutting to the high slot. Fed right side. Bear at the right hash marks. Put it side of the net. Mavin back in front. Bear missed it. McCrory. Scores! Shane Bear at the open net. And he just missed on the shot. But waiting there for it was Dylan McCrory. Nobody near him. And he wires that one into a yawning cage. Converts on the power play. And the Bandits make it a 2 to nothing game. The swarm is back on. And much looking like last night is this. Five bandits buzzing on. Them to make this one even closer. Here now is McCarr skating to the bottom of the right circle off the draw, cuts in front. He's wide open for a backhander, and it went wide left to the net. Oh. McCarr head off for a uh, for a change. McBride carries in, flicked ahead. Gadry's got a breakaway in on Houston forehead. Sprawling save by Garrett Houston, and he covers it up well down in his face for a whistle stopping play. Unreal by the bandit netminer. Then Gadry and Marshawn. Gadry's reach came to the slot. Morrison wide open to shoot one, and it's wide left to the net. Tucked back in front. Obviously, to Gadry shoots. It never got through. Like, but he may have stretched just enough to stay onside and ended up sticking it in deep. Well, Akmalo finishes a hard hit on Ethan James and knocks him down. Half up the left wing. Well, Akmalo's got a partial two on one with Mappin. Well, Akmalo carries in left wing to the circle. He shoots right on Gora. He makes a great save. All the way down to the bandit zone. Bear gets there first. Try to clear. Gadry picked it off. Put it to McBride in the slot. Shoots. What a save! by Houston. Up against Mackenzie Bauer. Lodermeyer won the draw. Left point to Joe O'Connor. Wines. Fires! Saved by Gore. I don't know if he saw that one. It caught him a bit by surprise. Section, but the third might be letting a lot more go, it looks like. Now the bandits carry and zigzagging to the slot as Bear. Got to run another man. Cuts out in front. Shoots! And that's lying at the right side of the net. Somehow Gora kicked back his left pad to keep that one out. McKechnie left corner to O'Connor left point to McCarr mid blue line to Lodemeyer right circle. Turn around shot keeps out of the net. Well, that's put it in front of McKechnie. Oh, he could not get a shot away. Gora. He was tied up with Perkusic. Now the bandits are partial two on one. Nackigal with Pereira. Nackigal's into the left circle. He shoots and it skips off Gora and may have gone off the left post. Nine in this game. Certainly a much bigger key in this game. Bandit shorthanded here at neutral. Malat carries in right wing with Lodemeyer. He's got space. Put it in front. Lodemeyer wide open. Shoots and scores. A thing of beauty, 20 seconds into the PK, Malat to Lodermeyer from the right corner to the slot, the captain's all alone to tuck that one past Patrick Gora and the Bandits make it 3-zip. You talk about effort and a matter of time and Jeff Malat just does yeoman's work as he charges down that wall. He wins that puck battle. 
throws it to a wide open Milot that just tucks it five hole. And what a huge goal here for the Bandits. Gloves it down, got behind his man, two on one with Bauer. Rebel out of right circle, shoots, saved by Houston! And it's two on two, McKechnie with Mick. Fed ahead, Mick barreling in down the middle. Held on to by Brown, got a one-handed shot away, save made. Rebound, Jen and McKechnie, stopped by Gora, and lead to the Kodiaks. Taps it back to the left wing corner, here's time map. Tapped at left point, Thompson winds, fires, save, rebound, McCurry! Backhanded it wide right. left half wall, we'll see if things get silly here late in this third period. What an awful cross check by Morrison. Just brutal. Bear, 20 seconds to go. Back to Marshawn, right point. Holds it, fakes a shot. Got it bottom right circle for Cusick. Sharp angle try, saved by Gora. Rebound, score! <laughs> Cusick sneaks one in from the side of the net. Costello will go over and shove at him a bunch of times after the goal. But it won't change the fact that the Bandits are now up four to nothing. Up the right wing and back ends one in deep, and that'll do it. Six seconds to go on the third. Fu gets to it in the left wing corner, try to center it to the escape. Gonna get shoved some extra times by Brown. Bears got the puck, but time expires, and the Bandits are up two games to none. Oh, the whistle went with six tenths of a second to go. I'm convinced they're gonna run this off, and the Bandits will win game two by a four to nothing final score. They run the clock, and the Bandits win. <laughs> Tonight, as Garrett Hewson ties the AJHL record for shutouts in a postseason, his fourth clean sheet of this playoff run, and Garrett Hewson etches his name in the history books as the Bandits take a 2 0 series lead.